Hello. So I had a cool idea that I wanted to test out on uh, Fur Affinity Forums, which was sort of doing a um, Fursona Mystery Envelope, which was a shot for me to just do a lot of like different experimental arts and crafts with one person's character. And I don't know if and when I'll do it again, if I'll do... There's other... Um, I basically just took the first request I got on Fur Affinity Forums. There's a few other requests that posted thereafter, and I kind of just said I was like just doing the one for then. So I might consider doing those eventually, or I might sell it eventually, or I might just not come back to this for a while. But either way, this was pretty interesting. Um, and the person that asked for um, the request was Universe the Dragon. If you're on Fur Affinity Forums, you've probably seen them around because they post on there a lot. And I just kind of wanted to get into showing what I made. I still kind of need to figure out how to best package it, but to start, I will be do putting it in this envelope, which I um, scribbled on. So, Persona Mystery Envelope 4, Universe the Dragon Human Hybrid, because technically next to their name, they have it written as that. I don't know if they always consider it to be that, or if they sometimes consider it to just be an anthro dragon, but they have that next to their name, so I put it there. And yeah, he has a lot of different art, so I, for my references, kind of gathered some I've seen him post in different places, because he only really provided um, one info on the first um, post that I made, but I said I was going to go do that. Um. And let me go through and show you the pieces I made. Well, first, really quick, let me just say here's the note I wrote. That's just hard to see when I hold it up like this. And then on the back is my list of items, but I'm not going to show you that yet. And the front of the note says, I hope you enjoy this universe-themed mystery envelope. Included is eight handmade art slash craft pieces. The back of this note lists what they are. So, read after viewing everything if you don't want spoilers. Kyoku. So, here we go. Um, let's see, I'll start saying some of these simpler things. So, I got this little art and paper craft piece that um, is painted with um, some acrylic paint on the green of the wings, but most of it is. Um, oil pastel, and then alcohol paint for the um, glitter. This is just kind of like a simple little cutout piece. Just something small and cute. Um, and then this next thing I have is an acrylic artist trading card, which I have in a sleeve. Um, I'll take it out real quick. Here you go. So that's done with acrylic pens. And on the back it ha says um, Kyoku and the date that it was made. One more look. Um, let's see. So here's a full art piece that was done sort of very stylized. Um, and it uses pens and alcohol markers, and I'll give you a closer look at that. And then the next thing I have here is actually a small clay head that was painted with acrylics and also then uh, dusted with chalk pastel. Um, and then the eyes were actually made using uh, drops of UV resin, which were painted in back and, um, you know, put into the clay in like a little tiny uh, half circle mold was some um, the mold I used for the resin. And I kind of like outlined everything. It's almost like you'd see in like comic books or Borderlands or certain video games. So it's kind of 
interesting sort of effect. Mm -hmm. um, the next thing I made was this sort of experimental washi tape and um, uh, scrapbook paper um, badge. So it's his paw and then his name. And you can kind of take a look at it. Some kind of interesting things with mixing up the washi tape with some messages in there. Possibly something that could be read as a dad joke. <laughs> but yeah, hope he likes it. And you can see um, the stripe like right behind where it says universe is sort of like shiny and gold. So I thought that looked cool. Um, and the next thing I did was this, um, um, filament piece with my 3D pen. And so, he has his head, paws, and tail, and he's holding, like, a little planet and a star. And this is, this is pretty fun. Um, second to last was this uh, postcard, so it's bordered in washi tape, and then the picture is done with watercolors, and they were uh, pearlescent watercolors, so it's like very pastel-y and sparkly, um, and then you can see on the back it's an actual postcard you can send out. And then lastly, um, I actually like making uh, animal paper dolls, although a lot of times I do watercolor faces, but to make this one different, I did it fully with paper craft. And this is a little paper doll I made. Um, really like how it came out. And that's everything. Hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you think it's a cool idea. Uh, if I ever do decide to like sell them or something, I have no idea at all how much I charge for them or how it would work out, but you know, just things to think about and either way it was fun to try. <laughs> See you!